everyone, JagTagger93 here, back again with our Doom Watt to play through. This one is called Level Num 2. Uh, it's by Andrew Scotland, and I might have got myself into a bit of a pickle with this one. Um, it just says Run to Survive, so I'm wondering what kind of map this is going to be. Oh, it's going to be one of those. Okay, so let's... um, 63 enemies. Okay, that's not bad. So, what I'm guessing here is that this is going to be one of those gimmicky maps where we got to run from item to item and find our way to the exit. So it'll be fun, actually. I'm going to see if I can do this. Um, there's 63 enemies, but I'm willing to bet a lot of these enemies are pretty substantial. There might be like arch files and um, cyber demons, even a spider mastermind or two in the way as well. Um, it's going to take some trial and error, though. 63 enemies. I'm going to give myself... Three lives. I'll do three lives and one save to try to get through this one. Um, 63 enemies is not a lot at all in Doom. It isn't, but I'm getting a sense just by how I initial impressions, having a whole bunch of items right in front of us right here, and just the description, run to survive. I'm guessing it's one of those gimmicky maps, so I'm going to be a little generous with the lives here and say three. So, uh... Let's try this one and see what it what it's like. Hope everyone out there is having a good weekend, by the way. Yep, we got some uh, pinkies. I don't... I kind of want to keep them alive. Don't want them wasting am ammo. Um, hit scanners are almost always kill on sight, though. Oh, I hear a cyber demon. Yep, Cyber Demon. I like keeping the pinkies alive, if I can help it, as like meat shields. If I can help it, if they're my way, I'm going to turn them into a kibble. I really hope we don't have to go back in that cyber demon room. Now, I can't really stop and look at the flowers, um, because we got to keep moving. But, uh, yeah, this map is pretty freaking ugly. I'm, I'm sorry, but it is. Oh, shit! It followed us! Keeping those pinkies alive to act as, uh, little meat shields for the incoming rockets. Okay. Okay, where am I going? Alright. I feel like we've already seen a good portion of the map, but... Come on, come on! Yes! Want to take out this cyber demon? Ah, this is right back to the beginning. Shoot. All right. Well, I guess I'll use my one and only save here. Oh God! What just happened? Oh god, okay. Well, I died. And what sucks is... I didn't save. I wanted to, then I saw, like, something weird happening. Ah. Uh, Alright, so I have two lives left. But I think my strategy of keeping the pinkies alive was a smart one. Oh, BFG, nice. Orange key? Okay, good. So let's go back the way we uh, did the first time to grab the other two keys. Oh shit. Mm. Mm. 
Oh yeah, I'll take that. Wonder where this goes. Oh nowhere. Okay. All right, invulnerable spear makes this a lot easier. Oh god, he's back. Do I want to play with him? Uh, nope. Ah, I did not need to take that. Where was the other key? I'm trying to remember. Hmm. Oh lord, he's coming. He's coming. I gotta clear out some room. Alright. Alright. I just hear that server even stomp and stomp and stomp and coming closer. Okay, where was that other key? Oh shit! Oh, there it is. Okay, good. Alright. Now I'm gonna save. This will be my one save. I'll call it, um, numb, I guess. Alright. So I'm at one save, one death so far. I have two more lives left. I think we'll be alright. Just gotta figure out where the hell we're going. Another key. Okay, why? Um, there is such a thing as having too many keys on a map. It just, no. Oh god. Alright, where do I want to go? Oh, shit. Ah, I was hoping I could have killed him. Alright, I have one more life left. But I think we gotta go there. If I can find another invulnerability sphere, that'd be great. Okay, that's the teleporter to Doom. Well, okay, we're playing Doom, but you know what I mean. I wonder where this goes. Alright, nowhere. <sighs> Swear to God, this map is, um, hmm, kind of pissing me off. I hear that cyber demon stomping around close by too, and I don't want to mess with him, especially with how odd the uh, proportions. Okay, so that that teleporter works. Weird, but yeah, how jagged and everything is, so it's kind of hard to kind of move and maneuver. Well, not hard, but just awkward. I can't really quite describe it, but if you play Doom for a while, you know what I mean. Um, if you have like a perfectly perfect, you know, square, or perfect uh, rectangle room, you can kind of get a sense where the walls are without always having to look. But if things are just, you know, jutting out willy nilly, you can kind of forget where things are and lose track of where stuff is. Yes, there's the other other one. Grab it, grab it. Nice. Alright, now we gotta go to the um 
Actually, I wonder what's over here. Okay, there's a red door. We gotta get over to there. Come on. Ah, shoot. Damn it. Ah, okay. Well, we... I wanted to keep the uh, invulnerable sphere going, get to that teleporter, this one here. That's been giving us issues. I wonder if I can retreat. No. Damn it. Alright, well, I'm a man of my word. That was, uh... That was my three lives. Just for funsies, I wonder how close we were to the end. I'm going to resurrect. And yeah, God. Alright. Once we get these chunguses out of the way. Was that the end of the map? It was. Wow. Alright. Well, there you have it. That was uh, Numb 2. Um, yeah, that's kind of a... Ugh. I'm... Sh I'm wondering if there's another way to the exit than the teleporter. If so, then that's not entirely unfair, but having two cyber demons right there is uh, <laughs> pretty cheesy. Um, what can I say that's good about this map? Well, I like the premise. I, I love the premise of, um, and, and a lot of maps do it, and admittedly do it better, but where you have to run from item to item in vulnerability sphere to unvulnerability unvul unvul sphere while dodging monsters and so forth, and giving you very little cover to do it. That works really well. I also kind of liked the jagged architecture in a weird way, too. It constantly gave me a sense of unease as well and forced me to be extra alert to my surroundings. Like, with all the jagged corners, there are tons of places that the author could have put in um, a hit scanner or a revenant or something to just, you know, jab at us, punch at us, or shoot a rocket at us from, you know, a uh, covered corner or something like that. But uh, I didn't really get a sense that that was, that was being done here. I was too busy just running for my life, really. Um, I liked, too, how the map was catered to players who keep the pinkies alive to act as meat shields. If you do that, you should be able to get through this map pretty easily until the very end, where apparently you got two cyber demons waiting for you, you know. But, um, again, I, I would not be surprised if there's some alternate way to get to the end other than using the teleporter. And if you, you know, there's plenty of invulnerability spears here, too, so if you grab an invulnerability spear and get to the end with the BFG, total cakewalk you can make the uh you can paint the walls red with cyber demon blood not a problem so i'm not saying this map is cheap or anything um it's very much trial and error unfortunately though there's not a lot here to really uh, make you want to play this one i mean get a shot if you want it, it's 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 okay it won't take many uh veteran players much time to get through and uh yeah that's all i really have to say about it thank you all for watching this is jag tagger 93 signing out you have a good one